Heroes and heroines of all ages. When the world tells you to get a life, you're always welcome at the one-up block. My name is Dan the Man, your host, and I'm slowly moving the mic away. Uh, welcome back to another episode of Let's Play The Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask. When we last left off, we, uh, were certainly not in the Zora Hall. We were actually over in Akana Valley, but there is something we can do now that we've met all these Deku scrubs. Uh, if you recall, we were doing a little mission where we, uh, we got a bunch of hard pieces for finding these deeds, and this is the mountain title deed. And, now, the first one we had to talk to was in town, who we gave the moon's tier to. The second one you have to talk to is in the swamp. Sorry, I was listening to the link. The, the second one is in the swamp, and he's on top of the, uh, the boat cruise little area. You know where he is. We bought the beans from him. Uh, stop it, Link. Uh, the third one is found in the mountain village, which we've already seen as well. Uh, you just go to the Goron village and walk to the right, and he's just against the wall. And then after you get that, you have the mountain deed, which we now have. But we can talk to this guy. You're gonna have to be wearing the Goron's mask. Uh, you have to be wearing the, uh, appropriate, uh, race's mask, like where the deed comes from. So because this is the mountain deed, we're gonna be needing to... We're going to need to wear the Goron's mask. So let's talk to him, shall we? Thanks for stopping by. Oh, you're from the mountains. I'm selling green potions, but I'm focusing my market on my marketing efforts on Zoras. Actually, I'd like to do business someplace where it's cooler and the air is clean. But to open a business in another place, you need to go through the proper channels first. Do you know what I mean? And just like the other guy, he's talking about the deed. <gasps> oh, that's the mountain title deed. Thank you. I'll give you this land in exchange. Ba -na -na -na. You got the ocean title deed. Yahoo! I'm off to the resort. The mountains are calling me. And just like that, there's actually something pretty funny in this room. <laughs> Conveniently placed for this Deku. There's a hole in the roof. <laughs> this is, uh, this is Lulu's room, by the way. We have never been in here before. Uh, we didn't come in here because we really didn't need to, because the Deku scrub was something we couldn't really touch upon back then. But, I mean, now we can, so now we're looking at Lulu's room. Uh, Lulu's room is kind of busted up now because I think the hole came from the pirates bur bursting in and stealing her eggs as you can see there's a skimitar over here which implies that some rough housing took place but with that said we can now hop up here and grab this heart container da 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 you got a piece of heart you've collected three pieces so far collect more to expand your heart okay so one more and we'll get a new heart container a new heart container is that right it's <laughs> I love the way Deku Link <laughs> oh man all right but yeah now we can get out of here we're actually gonna need to uh put on the bunny mask the bunny hood we're gonna put on the bunny hood so we can get out of here faster now we're gonna need to go back to Akana Valley uh, as you can see I've also got a big chunk of change down there that's so we can go and do the mini game that we found in Akana Valley before we do anything else all right let's see uh pff, what am I needing to do the song is soaring Alrighty. Sorry, if you can hear that scrolling, it's me actually looking uh looking something up. Let's see, we wanna go to ba -ba 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 Ikana Valley, which is over here. Or Ikana Canyon. Go. Alrighty. Sorry, it's quite unprofessional of me, but you know. I wanted to make sure I knew something before I actually went into the uh, the mini game again because you know. Uh, bu -bu 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 -bu. One second. All right, all right. Sorry about that. I'm back. I'm back. Let's do this. Um, now that we're back here in Akana Valley, uh, what you're gonna want to do is come over here and jump off. Hopefully you'll. Yeah, no, I didn't. I did not land. You didn't. You don't really need to go that way. You just need to be able to get back up here. Which you can do by going this way. Is this river pushing? It is pushing the other way. Well, that's irritating. But, you know, it's not that bad. So come back up here and waddle your way over to this little canyon area that we've seen before. Don't bother with Tattle. She's just going to tell you to put on the Garo's mask to fight the Garo. All the Garo's really do is give you hints as to what you're supposed to do next. Um, just like before, we'll have to put on the Zora's mask because the Zora... Is from the ocean. Thanks for stopping by. You're from the ocean, aren't you? 
I'm here to sell blue potions. Actually, I want to do business in the sea breeze while listening to the sound of the waves. But to open a business in another place, you need to go through the proper channels first. Do you know what I mean? So just like that, we'll give him the deed. <gasps> oh, if that isn't an ocean title deed, let me have that. Please, if I have that, dr that my dreams will come true. I'm not asking for it for free. I'll give you this. Da -na 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 -na. He'll give us a huge rupee. This is the first time we've seen this rupee. It gives you 200 rupees in total. Oh yeah, the nut brown beauties are waiting. <laughs> the 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 what? The nut brown beauties. Okay, whatever. I'm not gonna question it. I'm just not. <laughs> oh, what the hell? Did you see his shadow there? Oh boy. But we no longer have any uh quest items because that that was the last of the uh the quests that, that was the last of the deed quests so now we can use this to hop over here and of course just like always there's going to be a heart piece for us this heart piece is actually going to give us a full heart i believe yeah you piece of heart yeah we got a full heart from that okay cool so now with that's all said and done we can actually continue with uh, our little adventure which we only wasted a couple of hours so that's not really that bad uh, take this mask off. I'm gonna put the bunny hood back on because there's no, there's no particular uh, mask that you need for this part. So, uh, yeah. If you want to buy a blue potion from that guy before you uh, make him go away, it's probably a good idea. I probably should have done that myself, but you know, he does give you 200 rupees back. So we would have had, we would have gotten our money back plus had an extra hundred to spare but it's not really that big of a deal you don't really have to worry about a blue potion uh blue potions i believe give you infinite magic i think we'll figure it out eventually i think it's a good idea to take one into the next dungeon but we're not going to be actually doing that for a little while uh before we do the mini game however we are going to progress in the story a little bit because as you recall we sort of made the water flow again, which made this little music box on top of this house play. And what that did was kill all the Givdos. Now if you can see over there, there's a little girl. Let's go talk to her. Hey, little girl! Well... <laughs> we spooked her. And she ran away. So... That's no good. Now, let's, uh, let's try to get her attention. Let's see, a, a bomb should do it, right? Huh. Now let's go hide so she doesn't see us. All right. Whoop. Shh, 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 shh. And whenever she's not looking and can't see us, let's go into her house. <laughs> We're sneaky, sneaky little devils. Oh, hey. This place is kind of nice. And the song is cool, even though it sounds very Mario 64. Uh, oh, hey, look. It's a, it's a peephole. Well, I guess that's how... Oh, there's peepholes all over the place. I guess that's how she's been watching everything. That's a little creepy, little girl. Not gonna lie. There's a downstairs. I wonder what's down here. Oh, it's like the music is coming out of these speakers. Termina has a lot more uh, technology than Hyrule does, if you couldn't tell. Which uh, I think plays on the theme that I'm gonna get into later whenever we get to the next dungeon. But Hyrule is a uh, more traditional fantasy... Uh, where they live off the land and they believe heavily in their gods. This place is more technology-driven, where they, you know, sort of go off themselves. But, uh... Oh, what the... Hey, it's a Gibdo! And a, Oh, my word! What the hell is that? <laughs> uh, 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 this mummy looks different. Sort of like he's waiting for its human heart... For its human heart to be healed. Well, do something. Haven't you figured it out yet? Okay, so yeah, that's a, that's a... Stop it! Who are you? What are you doing just walking into people's houses like that? Don't! It's me! It's Pamela! Oh lord. Well, there seems to be some... bad stuff going on here. Get out! Forget everything you've seen here and get out! Okay, so that was odd, but I'm not done here. I want to know what the hell's up with that freaking mummy guy. All right.
Watch your little squirt. You're gonna make way for the link. For a link to the past. Alrighty. Wait for her to walk on by. And then Metal Gear Solid. Bump, 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 bottom. Bump, 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 bottom. Bump, 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 bada, bump, 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 bada, bottom, bada, dum. Bottom, bada, dum. And just like that, we're gonna make him pop out again. The scene's just gonna replay just like it did before. However, this time, if we go look into our music, as you recall, we have the Song of Healing. This song has helped us heal a bunch of troubled souls throughout the entire adventure, so, you know, maybe it'll help this guy out, so let's attempt it. It is also the creepiest song in the game, unfortunately. Not because it's a creepy song or anything, but... Well then, father, father, Pamela, what have I been doing this whole time? You haven't been doing anything. You had a bad dream. You were just having a little nightmare. Pamela. Well, that was pretty deep. But we get a new mask out of it. You got the Gibdos mask. This mask was once a hideous, the hideous face of Pamela's father. This mask looks so real that even Gibdos would mistake you as one of its own. We should probably leave them alone. Let them be. Don't you get it? You're so insensitive. So, yeah. That's a touching little story. We helped Pamela get her dad back. She was protecting her dad. Uh, if you come to the door while the Gibdos are still walking around, she'll tell you that her dad isn't one of them. I forgot to show that off, but... Yeah, it's a nice little story there. See, this is why I love this game. Everything about it is just so pleasant, and you're helping people out all the time, and... It's just nice. But, as you recall, we do have some unfinished business over here, and we have just enough time to uh, show it off. Is this it? Spirit House. Yes, it is. Let's do it. Alright, so this guy, last time we found out that we can uh, play a game to prove that we have courage or whatever. Prove that we're strong. Uh, back here we have the Poe sisters. They are... Amy, Joelle, Beth, and Meg. That's what I was looking up on the other screen, by the way. So, uh, yeah, that's the Poe sisters. Quite possibly my fa- one of- It's not really one of my favorite characters. They are, like, a group of my favorite characters from Ocarina of Time, because they're such an interesting boss that, uh, you know, it's just- it's just cool, but let's- let's get on with this. If you're seeking blah blah blah, we already read this. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. 30 rupees. Eh, I don't want to do it. So... We played the Song of Healing to help heal all those other people's souls. This guy seems kind of creepy. I wonder what happens if we try to play it here. I mean, they are ghosts after all, so maybe we can set them free and not have to play the minigame at all. That'd be cool. Uh... <laughs> you cannot heal all souls with that song. If you have faith in my skills and try and... This. Try saving these wandering spirits. Hee hee hee. Their earthly cost will be 30 rupees. If you'd like to take that much, I'd like to be able to take that much, but I shall take 10 rupees. Take off 10 rupees. So, yeah, if you play the song. I read that entirely wrong, and I apologize for how bad I read. But if you play the Song of Healing, he, t he shaves off the price of the minigame by 10 rupees, which is really cool. And here I am pretending like I didn't know. <laughs> but if you're doing a Let's Play, you're typically going to do that. But yeah, let's do it. You are a boy of much vigor. Defeat the ladies within the time limit and, and rest their souls in peace. But if your life energy drops below three hearts, I will stop the match. Mercy is the least I can offer. Are you prepared? Yes. Okay, so this is just a little throwback to Ocarina of Time. We're actually going to be refighting all the Poe sisters, which is cool. It's Amy, youngest of the four ghost sisters. Target her when she appears. You got that? Okay, so the green one is Amy. Which is cool. I didn't know the I didn't know what her actual name was. I didn't know which one was which, basically. If you get close to them, they do that spin thing. But if you wait. Ah, son of a bitch. If you hit them with a jump attack, I believe they go down in one hit. But if you get close enough to them, they start doing this spin attack. But if you time it right, you'll be able to hit them. So as soon as they start spinning around, that's your chance to hit. 
So now we're fighting two of them at once. Who is this? The red one is Joe, second of the four ghost sisters. Aim at her when she appears. Okay, there's no time. So that's Joelle, and the blue one is Beth, the third of the ghost sisters. All right, so I think I'm going to go for Beth first. Why Beth first? I don't know. Why not? No, don't talk to Tattle. Why do I do that? Okay. No! Uh, oh, I missed! I got her. Kind of. So this isn't that bad. You'll have plenty of time to spare, because you have to you have to fight two of them right here, and that may seem like hard or something, but it's really not. See? One shot and it goes down. It. It's a girl. I missed. I don't think you can hit the mother invisible. Come on. Come on, Joe. What you got, Jojo? Kaboom! And for the final match, we have... This one's actually rather tough. It's very similar to Ocarina of Time. She's gonna go... She's gonna come back. And she's gonna be spinning around. The one that spins is the one that you wanna aim for, so... You're gonna have to use your bow and arrows for this. Alright. The one that spun was behind me, so it's this one. This is going to be the most time-consuming of all the sisters, obviously. Alright, it's the one behind me, I think. So, this one? Nope. Then it's that one. Ha-ha! <laughs> one more should do it. Alright, it's the one next to her. Let's do this. Alright! Alright! We had a whole minute to spare. It seems their souls have been healed. I give to you this earthly possession which the ladies kept. Take it, Dan. You got a piece of heart for collecting four heart pieces. Collect four pieces of the heart to assemble a new car container. Each new container you put together will increase the amount of life energy you have. Is that the first time it's given this that whole description? That is your name, correct? I can read people's hearts. I knew you would be coming here. Now, my own soul has been healed, too. With that, he 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 And he disappears. This house is now inert. There's nothing in this house anymore. We've set them all free. So that's really cool that we got the, the chance to do that. Plus, we got to see uh, Joe, Beth, Amy, and... Uh, what was the other one again? Meg. How could I forget Meg? <laughs> um, I don't think there's anything else too particularly interesting in this town as of right now. I think we've done all that we can. So uh, I think on that note, we're going to call it quits for this episode because uh, that's all the time we have for this episode. A hero's work is never done. Join me again next time as we continue to tackle The Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask. Later days, everybody.